now that you have the crown just kind of popped into place um, you kind of want to take a nice survey and kind of make note of things you want to fix like clearly this central um, the occlusal surfaces need some work the marginal ridges um, cusp placement is okay this is way over contoured so we'll kind of make a mental note of the things we want to do we can look at the opposing see oh well we're got lucky there and we're quite hyper occluded what we'll do is you can hit um, hole slash structure editing or you can hit the tab button this is just simply tabs you into edit mode I can hit A to deselect everything now you notice you can see the um, the rest of the cage through this front part if you turn this on this will kind of help you grab just the vertex you're looking at sometimes you have a tendency to accidentally select a vertex that's on the other side like that so make sure proportional editing is on it's uh it is already so let's see what I'll do first is look at it from the top grab this contour scroll up my proportional editing bubble and just kind of bring it in a little bit can look at it from the side and do the same thing here this marginal ridge quite high hit Z to make it just in the occlusal direction check your um, side views to make sure things are still okay and we'll deepen that groove by lowering that oblique ridge just a little bit so to me this looks okay I'm gonna hide the master and look just at the mesial and distal you can see we have I have actually had quite a nice amount of the mesh showing through. Um, those contacts aren't exactly where I'd like to place them, so I'll grab that one, push it in a little bit, grab this, and kind of move that contact out to the side. Okay, there we go. Buckle and occlusal to the middle of the crown. Cusp tips more or less in line. In line with the canine. Then to the second molar. Yeah, that's really good if we turn the opposing on. Ooh, we can see we're still pretty high there. Just a little bit. Okay, that's good enough for now. You can hide everything. Hit A to select all the vertices. Hold down K to cut. Make that cut and then hit trim excess. Then you can hit seat to margin. Everything will seat. Also, you notice this is a 
that got pushed in a little too far there. Okay, so now we're ready to do, um, now that it's wrapped into place, we're ready to fine tune, um, apply